Wrist mobility, so imperative, so important. I'm gonna give you a two minute routine that you should do every single day, especially if you're an office worker where you sit at a desk and you type all day. Some of the common injuries that you're gonna face is carpal tunnel, you're gonna get the trigger figure, and some type of tendonitis. Now carpal tunnel is where you trap the nerve in the wrist. Trigger figure is the inflammation of the finger tendons, and tendonitis is an overall inflammation of the tendons surrounding the entire wrist. Now it's been reported that 25% of all Canadians experience some type of wrist pain in the hand that prevents them from doing their job and there's a 63% chance that you as an office worker will develop some type of wrist injury so today I'm gonna to give you a two-minute wrist routine that you can practice every single day in the morning midday and then even before you go to bed let's get to it all right the first one that you want to do is you want to be sitting onto your knees or your thighs if you can't do that you can just offload with your hands or you can put a towel underneath your knees the first one you do is you're gonna have your fingertips point, pointing forward and all you're gonna simply do is just rock forward into the tips of your fingertips. So you rock back into the palms of the hands, you rock forward into the tips of the fingertips. Try that out guys, I'm gonna give you 10 seconds. All right, excellent job. Now we're gonna get the opposite side of that. We're still gonna focus on the wrist. We're gonna go fingers inwards this time. And this one, you're gonna feel more of a stretch. Fingertips are facing your thighs and all you're gonna do is sit back into your legs, okay? So you're gonna go from the palms of your hands and we're gonna sit back all the way into the fingers. You're gonna feel that higher into the wrist. So let's do this together for 10 seconds. Here we go. All right, this next one is a little bit weird, but it's great for the backs of the wrist. All you're gonna do is you're gonna start with your fists on here. Now, the more weight you put on, the harder it's gonna be. So just start light, keep your fingertips curled in, and all you're gonna do is just drop the back of your fists, and then keeping your elbows as high as possible. So mine are a little bit tight from tennis. I can really feel that, so this is a great stretch for me. I want you to do the same where you keep your elbows nice and high, and then you push up onto your fists, and then go down. Let's do it for 10 seconds together, you ready? All right, this last one, finger push-ups. No, you don't have to actually do a push-up, but this one is inspired by Bruce Lee. We're gonna splay the fingers, okay? So we're gonna put the hands on the ground, and all you're gonna do is just put your weight, and you're gonna feel that hand splay as much as you possibly can, then bring your fingers back to the center, and then let them splay out as far as you can. Bring them back to the center, let them splay, so you're really putting weight into those hands, and we're gonna spread the fingers as much as possible. Let's do this last one together, 10 seconds. So there we have it guys, we're gonna get rid of those sore hands, sore wrists, sore fingers, we're gonna get rid of all the tendonitis. I want you to do this even just for 10 seconds, three times a day, and it's gonna keep your wrists healthy, it's gonna keep you injury free, most importantly, it's gonna keep you in the gym, which you're gonna be fit and happy. So guys, I hope you enjoyed this video. Give the video a like, hit the subscribe button if you haven't, and put a comment in the sections whether or not you've tried this wrist exercises.